In this video, I'm going to be giving you a very quick overview on our Psychiatry HP notebook. So this is a five and a half by eight and a half inch notebook that's going to fit in your white coat pocket. And really it's catered more towards um, your psychiatry setting. It can be used both in the outpatient setting or in the inpatient setting. It doesn't have a progress template. Subsequently after this, it's just a two page template that's really for the admission setting. And so it's gonna be looking very similar to our other HB notebooks. However, the main difference are gonna be in a few things. One, we're gonna have much more room for your social history than we do in others because obviously social history is important. It's also gonna have different things for your review of systems, things that are more catered towards the psychiatry setting that are many systematic questions that you're going to be wanting to ask. It's also going to have an added benefit of the mental status and physical exam. So unlike our other exams, which kind of stop right here after neuro, we're going to have other portions of it that kind of give you almost like a mini mental status exam, behavior, mood, speech, memory, concentration, thought process, insight, and judgment. And within these, you will have a lot of tips. For example, let's say the concentration, serial seven, spelling world, forward and backward, three-step command. And so it'll give you a lot of hints in terms of, oh, I forget what is actually being asked in these mini mental status exams. And this will just give you a good hints or some, something to start off of if you're not remembering everything. Obviously, it's not as detailed as your typical mini mental status exam, which remembers a whole page, which has pictures and numbers and all sorts of things that you're going to be doing. But it's going to be a very abbreviated version if you're kind of in a punch and you, you need to figure out exactly what's going to be asked in a, in a, in a simple way. Every template is going to look exactly the same. And so it's going to be two, two pages. So you can kind of fold it in half and just take your history as you kind of go down the line and it's going to be in a very organized way and then this will fit in your Wyco template and it's a total of 100 patients that you can see so hopefully that that'll be enough for a one rotation that you're going to be on with each of these you're going to have a reference sheet and similar to other notebooks that you may have purchased in the past or have seen in the past it's going to have some of the same things but a lot more things that are more catered towards psychiatry so things to just point out they're going to have you know a psychiatric mental status exam so more detailed than what we'll have in the actual notebook itself it's going to have things for common drug antidotes you know this is more just for reference like if someone were to ask you not really something that you're going to be using on the spot because we we don't include doses in every anything just because doses can change for for different patients and for different hospitals and different settings and then also some common drugs of abuse more so with they presented a certain way what will they present as or maybe if they were draw withdrawing from a certain drug what are some common symptoms and some common exam findings so these are just going to give you a kind of a quick and dirty in terms of thinking about this more so from a pipping standpoint rather than using it as you know for, for for clinical practice or using it for any clinical advice but more so just for if a if attending were to ask you a certain question maybe one of those answers may be here and if you're not using it fold in half and it'll run inside your HMP notebook. Be sure to check out our website, medicalbasics.com, for more educational resources like our medical ID cards, scrub notes, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tips and lessons.